Welcome to Anderson Library. Why don't you come on in? It's after hours, but we can give you a tour anyway. So when you come into the library, you're coming in on second floor. This is the main floor. You'll notice the stairs to go up to the third and down to the first floor to your right. Food for Thought Cafe, which isn't open yet, but it will be returning soon. Circulation desk is on your left where you're going to check out materials. You'll notice over in the far corner there's large television and there's usually a seating area for book clubs and whatnot. And there are also different activities and events that take place there such as pet therapy. Those things will return soon. You can also see browsing DVDs, new arrivals, graphic novels, video games are these collections that you'll find on the second floor. And over to my left is a print station. The library has a number of print stations for you. Black and white printing, free. And you'll find them on first, second, and third floor. As we keep walking through the second floor, we'll see our handy scanner sedations, additional browsing books, restrooms and elevator, our computer alcove, which also has another print station for you. We hope you stop by the reference desk and ask us a question. Just say hello. Hi, Andy. Here's one that we're going to look for, Creatures of the Deep. Whenever you're looking for a call number, you always have to notice what floor, third floor, what collection, oversized, and the entire call number. Oh, that was handy. I've got it right here. We'll look for that a little bit later. Right across from the reference desk is the corridor that takes you to the instruction lab. You will have some classes there. Now we're entering in the curriculum collection where all of the pre-K-12 children's books, picture books, young adult novels, teaching tools are also located here. Robotics devices, so go ahead and browse the collection and get a feel for what we have. There's also a teaching area in the curriculum collection. So if your class is told to meet in the curriculum collection or the children's area of the library on second floor, this is where you'll be. If we keep on going, we'll find this whole other open area with study rooms that you can reserve. You'll notice the maximum capacity is written on the door and that these rooms can be reserved You'll go online to libcal.uww.edu to reserve them. Now let's take the long way around and we'll head back towards the stairs. But first, I want to make sure that you know about some of these other great places to sit and study. Behind the law collection. The reference collection, discover new music by checking out the, D, the CD collection, and now we'll head back to the entrance area so that we can take the stairs up to the third floor. third floor is a quiet study floor. On the third floor, you'll find a lot of other seating areas, individual study rooms, and again, don't mind our moving furniture. We're just getting ready, shifting things around a bit for fall semester. We'll take a look at the purple room. Here you'll find a mobile charging station, another touch screen scanner, and another print station. At the ends of some of the stacks, you'll see a book stack directory. Look up your call number, QH, 
stack number 146, and that will help you find the book that you're looking for a lot faster. Let's continue our walk around. There are large tables, study carols, some more soft seating. And if you like a little more wide open seating, here's a nice spacious area. Oh, cool. Try out one of our pods while you're at it. Let's head back. And this time, let's take the elevator down to first floor. I'll meet you down there. The first floor is also a quiet study floor. Down here, you'll find room 1105, the other library classroom. There are also a few collaboratories that you can reserve. One has a smart board. And if you keep working your way around, you'll find your way to special collections where you can research university history, genealogy, local history, You can also browse current periodicals here, as well as print, and scan some more. Let's walk back on up. Back on the second floor. So if I needed to check out that book, I'd stop here at the circulation, and I'm on my way out. Come and visit. Bye now.